It has been three years since I entered that godforsaken mine. I've forgotten the faces of my family. I've forgotten what the sun feels like. I've forgotten the sweet taste of raspberries. I have not forgotten that manganese... Manganese drives me. Manganese rules me. I tied my destiny to that ore. To that necessary bit of creating steel. And the drive to continue to find it led me to this. I will now return to the surface to figure out what still needs to be done. Do I indeed have enough to go to the moon? Welcome back to Zorg Goes to the Moon. Uh, in case you missed the end of the last one, I decided that I was going to take a bit of a stream break and uh, just do some mining. Because I was having an excessive amount of difficulty locating mangan... Oh, creeper up there. Locating manganese ore, which is necessary to create steel. And, uh, so I just hollowed out a huge area underground. Um, I have a giant pile of ores and other stuff. I've thrown out several hundred stacks of, uh, stone. I have more rubies than you can possibly dream of doing anything useful with, because they're not actually useful. I've got piles of shards if I ever wanted to do anything magical. Um, I've just... I've been digging... And, uh, now I have, well, let me dump this in there, let me empty out this, grab all the useless stuff. Ooh, a sapphire, cool. I don't need it for anything. go. That's already pretty much full. More rubies. Oh god, so many freaking rubies. Get the shards in there. That's where they go. The dust, the quartz, the quantum ore, the really random <laughs> piles of everything. Um, hey, where was I? Ah uh, yes, pulling all of this out of the backpack. Had to set up a whole new chest for this stuff. I'd thrown uh, a bit more. Let's get the silicone in there. Let's get the coal in there. There's some more slime. We've got a bit more slime over here. Because the fun thing about giant underground areas is that slimes like to spawn. And we like slimes because they allow us to make really tough tool rods once we get around to it. Dump all that stuff in there. Um, I don't even know all the ores that I have. I've thrown a pile of stuff into the smelter. Um, I think I've got something like 306 steel ingots ready to go, so we have plenty of steel for anything we need to do. Uh, gold I want, manganese I want... Uh, osmium, I don't think we'll need. Uranium, red, silver, iron, we need. Tin is going to be helpful. Um, more iron, more iron. And I don't know if you saw in the walls of the exposed chamber, but there are just piles of more resources if I need them. So, we are now officially in a post-scarcity Minecraft world. I have whatever materials I need to make pretty much anything, and uh, we're going to rocket from here on out. Quite literally, build a rocket. So I am excited, and I want to thank you all for sticking with me through the first, you know, 30 episodes of this. That's uh, 15 hours, if I do the absolutely terrifying math, not counting the, uh, the significant length of time that today's mining session 
uh, involved. Um, good grief, that's almost a full week at work. Well, I'm having fun. I hope you guys are having fun. Because now we're getting to the technically complicated good stuff. Bubble thing. Solar generator needs more steel. We've got steel. Oh, we have so much of the steel. We're going to start pouring some of that steel out. We're going to figure out where our builds were. Um, you know, I've got some leather. Let's get some item frames. And... Let's uh, start identifying things. Do some of this. Alright, so this is going to be rocket bits. So let's, what can we use to represent a rocket? Um, I know, I'll make a gear. And I think we're going to get fancy enough that we are going to make an aluminum gear if, or an iron gear that'll work. Um, iron gear apparently does not work. Oh, I have to make a stone gear first. Sorry, my bad. I'm getting ahead of myself. Alright, there's the rocket box. Uh, this is the electronics box, so we'll use a bit of redstone for that. Seems good. This is the ore box, so let's go grab ourselves a hunk of gold, because gold is fancy. All right. There's that. Uh, this one is most... I don't even know what that one is. That one's... Food stuff. Uh, okay, well, we got three chests labeled. Those are good enough. This chest is empty. We'll take it out of the center here. Alright, get ourselves some steel all up in this. There's our giant power station, which seems to be doing really well. start compressing ourselves some steel. Because we can. Alright. Where are we at? We need build some fins. And a nose cone. And we got some buttons here. Those are going to come in handy. Alright, rocket, what do we got? 
nose cone. Three of those and a redstone torch. Oop, need the redstone torch first. We built ourselves a nose cone. And for the fin, compressed steel and heavy duty plates. We're going to need four of those. Alright, let's go grab some of this compressed steel. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Four rocket fins. Awesome. Let's see here. We're also going to need a rocket engine that's going to take an oxygen vent, a canister, flint and steel, a button, and heavy duty plate. We've got the vent, we've got the canister, we need flint and steel. Uh, flint, I just put in this crate back here. Steel is actually iron because Minecraft logic. Got the buttons, got the vent, got the canister. Flint and steel, button, canister, vent, and uh, heavy duty plate. Is it two of those? Yeah, it is. Or four of them, sorry. There's our tier one rocket engine. Yeah, buddy. All right, so that means that we now have, let's get that stuff into the components section. Let's get these into the machine pile up here. Food. Base chicken eggs, fins, engine. That's technically a rocket, but we need to build a bench first. Component bits are going in there. Non-component bits are going to come out of there. I'm not going to... Uh, I'll leave the rail in there. These are technically component bits. Let's drop those out. All right. Where was I? Oh, I should probably eat some raspberries. Nom 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 nom. Oh, hello, spider. You wearing a hat? Okay. Our next challenge is going to be building the NASA workbench. Compressed steel, advanced wafer, crafting table, levers, and a redstone torch.
Why is this doing that? I don't know why it's doing it. Oh, it's nighttime. Ha! Huh. And the solar panel doesn't work at night. I wonder if there's batteries. There's probably batteries. We'll figure that out. Alright. What am I doing? NASA workbench. We need... we've got compressed steel. We need levers. Levers take... Regular cobblestone. Advanced way for a redstone torch crafting table. is going to go to a solar panel, but that's okay. So it goes advanced wafer, torches, compressed steel, crafting table, redstone. Alright, we have ourselves a NASA workbench. This is going to go over here in a point of pride. Do, do, do. Jam. Check that out. Ah, it's so cool! So cool. Alright, so what's left? We need to make solar panels. Okay, hang on. bubble thing. We're just going to scratch that. We don't need to dig anymore. But we do need fuel. That's what we were working on. Alright. Portable oil extractor. Bronze steel, redstone. Bronze, steel, redstone. All right. Canister. That is tin, tin canister, steel, and glass. Tin, tin canister. I'm pretty sure it was. We'll find out. That'll be good. Alright, we got our liquid canisters, our portable oil extractor. I don't really know how this thing works, but... We'll find out. When it's daytime. Okay. Um, 
have liquid canisters. A fuel loader. What does a fuel loader take? Steel, tin, basic, aluminum. I think I want to create two of those. So that means I'm going to need another basic wafer. Basic wafers are diamond, silicon, redstone, and a redstone torch. Alright, we've got our fuel loader. Two of them at that. Yep, now it's daytime. This should. I wonder if that hill's blocking it. Now we'll find out. is having some really weird power issues with that thing. Let's see if there's a battery. Compressed tin, redstone, coal. I think I'm all out of compressed tin. We can fix that.
This is really obnoxious. Do not like having power issues. So once this hits 100%, really obnoxious. Why am I not getting power? Is it relying solely on this thing to generate electricity? It shouldn't draw that much. Are. Oh well, at least it's working now. Get ourselves a redstone repeater. So that way we can make another solar panel.
Alright, let's drop some of this stuff back in the appropriate bins. giant freaking tree in the way. shower of everything. All right, I think that we are pretty good for right now. We've got a massive amount of materials to work with. We've got uh, a plan. We're significantly closer to um, getting where we need to be, which is the moon. Um, so we're going to start doing moon base stuff. That means we need glass trees, dirt, bone meal, and uh, bubble, I guess. All right. 
Thanks for watching. Catch you next time when Zor goes to the moon.